Hi everyone, my name is Avery Kelly and I am a CEO, a creator, a writer, director, and I also do philanthropy work. I have my own production company, Inspired Melanin, which I'm the CEO of, which works to create scripted and non-scripted projects that are representing the underrepresented, whether or not that's through scripted works, through non-scripted works. We also have our own philanthropy drive called Love Carries On as well that works to help foster children. So I do a lot of different branches, but I definitely am a heavy filmmaker as well. So my most recent project is a short film that I did as a part of the Black Girls Film Camp 2023 cohort. The program is absolutely amazing. And thanks to them, I was able to create my own short film called The All Arounds, which focuses on the story of two 40-year-old frenemies who are working together to save their old Double Dutch Rec Center. They have come back together for the first time since they were younger to be able to re-get their team together, to be able to just, it's a story really of sisterhood. It's a story story of representation it's the story of double dutch culture and thanks to black girls film camp and the entire team i just was able to pull it together and we just recently premiered it at the black girls film camp screening and showcase it won best overall film which i'm so incredibly grateful for and we are continuing to put the project in a different film festivals and to just be able to share it with the world so that's my most recent project so if you want to hear even more about it feel free to follow the film on instagram at the all arounds Honestly, in terms of my inspiration for what I do, it started off, actually, I really wanted to be an actress. I had written my own monologue and did a self-tape audition, and I got a call back, but I realized I wasn't the best actress in the world. I just wasn't. And so after writing that monologue, I realized my passion for screenwriting, and I knew that I wanted to be able to create works that showcased my people on the screen in a positive light that we didn't always get to see. And that's how my journey really started it all started off with me wanting to be an actress and life said no to that <laughs> but I also am a dancer as well and dance has had a really big influence on what I do so I'd say those two things are the main things that really inspired me to be where I am one of my biggest inspirations is Debbie Allen. I love Debbie Allen. She is not only a dancer, which is something that I am as well, but she also is the director of my favorite show, A Different World. Everything that she does just has such a positive impact on me. I've never once personally met her, but I really hope to. And just every single thing she does resonates with me so, so, so incredibly much. Like, it just is absolutely mind-blowing and amazing and one of my biggest inspirations personally in my life is my mom my mom is my best friend my ride or die the main person i go to she's my mom she's just everything she wears so many hats in my life and it's just my biggest inspiration of teaching me what a woman is what a strong woman is and i just cannot thank the lord enough for blessing me with her but that is definitely my biggest inspiration on this planet is my mother, Amy Kelly, but my biggest industry inspiration is definitely Debbie Allen. She just, she, I love her. <laughs> Some advice that I would give to some other girls who may want to go into the field of creating, writing, directing. If you want to do it, just do it. It don't matter your age. It does not matter your race, your ethnicity. It doesn't matter your background. If there's something that you want to go out and do, just do it. And if you don't know how to, use Google. We have now in our generation, in our time, we have so many different resources that we can use to be able to help us. So I highly suggest if you there's anything that you want to do just research it and don't be afraid to reach out and just go for it don't let any negativity bring you down you can do it regardless of any any boundaries you feel that you have just go ahead and do it and you never know what can come from it so that's the advice that i have